What's up? Haven't made a video in a while, and I wanted to show you this. So uh, we had kind of a free afternoon, and um, one of our customers wanted us to make a bench for out front. They had a flower box that got ripped apart, and uh, since everybody's got to stay outside in these crazy, crazy times, they wanted a bench out there. So I grabbed this slab of oak out back. It's got some really cool spalting on the front. Kate and I just uh, get done working on it. I actually stuck a couple of uh, Dutchman and Cherry Dutchman in the cracks real quick. This one I did kind of different. I put the bigger one on the inside, covering the two cracks and the smaller one on the outside. I think it's going to be a little bit different. But uh, I want to, um, I'm going to oil it up with boil linseed oil here and I want to get it on video. So let's uh, get you some more boil linseed oil. Let's get you up here. I'll take you for a walk by too as I I might get out of frame while I'm doing this, but I'll take you for a walk by when I dump it on. So it's gonna be uh, an outside slab. Something for customers to sit on. You just cut some logs out of the pile, some weathered pine logs for the base. It's gonna be on concrete, so nothing's gonna get rotted out. So this jug of oil, linseed oil here. See how it's gonna look. Hopefully, I'm right in front of you guys. So it's a red oak slab. We milled a few uh, a couple years ago. It's gonna be pretty cool looking. Gonna have to get some more boiled linseed oil, I can tell you that. Haven't had to use any in a while, been doing so many other things. We haven't uh, been doing a whole lot of projects around the house, so it's kind of fun today, There's the two of us out here working together. Man, the spalting is outstanding in the front. Wait till you see this. Dutchman came out cool. Kate's inside making up a sign that says, do not sit on it, it's wet. It's going to be wet till probably tomorrow sometime. Before I go over the whole thing again, I'll give you guys a look at it here and end this video quick. Actually, let me mop up this one see while it's sitting down here. Crack, the end grain. A couple chunks of linseed oil on the top. Yeah, that's a pretty slab. This is gonna be, this can be more than what they wanted. They kind of just they. Um, we do a bunch of other work for them. I actually sell them seafood too. And uh, he wanted just a basic slab, so we sometimes we don't do anything really basic. So we try to dress it up a little bit. I'll give you guys a good look. Well, it's been running the whole time. Yeah, it's really pretty. I left a few of the mill marks in it. We, you know, we milled this log ourselves. Those cherry bow ties are pretty cool. The spalting in it is outstanding. Beautiful. Yeah, be a real nice bench. So if any of you ever go by Silver Beach Pizza and Seafood up in my area, Cape Cod, you sit out front and wait for your order, you'll be sitting on a bench that Kate and I made. I'll uh, post up some pictures and everything, you know. Oh, that's it. Say hi, Sid.
she's like kind of mad because we're using all kinds of power tools and stuff so she's not exactly thrilled but uh yeah really cool it's like eight feet long it's gonna be more than it's gonna exceed what he was what he was hoping for those bow ties are really neat this log was cut this slab just came just kind of split the pith as you can see so yeah it's nice all right hope you guys are having uh, a great sorry try not to get the boil linseed all on my phone you guys are having a great safe day and uh hope you're all healthy have a great day thanks